Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. So today I'm going to show you how you can fix the problem when Claymore instantly crashes. But before we begin, as always, please consider subscribing, uh, turn on post notifications so you always know when I upload a new video and also like and share the videos. Now, if you don't know already, you can go to my channel, go to the playlist in here and you can find a playlist with certain videos. So you don't have to look around through all of my videos to find a video you want. But instead you can go to the playlist and you can find uh, the video category which you want to see. And for this, uh, for this kind of uh, episodes you can find uh, a playlist with only how to fix problems with your mining rigs. So basically the problem what I'm talking to about today is when you uh, open your miner to get it to mine and the miner or claim or miner in this case instantly crashes or it closes right away uh, like in this case for example so let's remove this file in here and let's try so as you can see as soon as I open the miner the miner instantly crashes or closes so this uh, basically means that um, uh, let's say usually not uh, always but uh, usually this problem is related to a missing file on the claymore folder which means that uh, your antivirus or your Windows Defender, uh, when you have uh, downloaded your Claymore Miner, your latest Claymore Miner, uh, your uh, antivirus has, um, has stopped some of the files from the Claymore folder. So uh, basically you get this thing in here when you try to open the Miner, it doesn't open at all. So what you can do now, it's really, really easy. You just go to your antivirus if you have one and you go to the quarantine file uh, through your antiviruses, uh, antivirus and then uh, there you will find the, uh, the files that the antivirus has deleted or quarantined from the, uh, from the claim or minor folder. In this case, I don't have an antivirus, but I just have the Windows Defender. And I think that most of you has this one. So what you need to do is really easy. You just go to the Windows Defender. And the first thing you need to do is shut down Windows Defender uh, real-time protection. So you go to Viruses and Threat Protection, then go to viruses and threat pro uh, threat protection settings and in here you have real time protection and you just click off click on yes to confirm this and now as you can see uh, windows defender is uh, it's turned off so what you need to do next it's uh, go you go uh, to windows defender go to viruses and threat protection then go to viruses and threat protection settings again and uh, down here you'll find exclusions so click on add or remove ex exclusions click on add an exclusion folder because we are going to exclude a folder then find the folder of claymore which you unzipped the first time mine is on desktop is this one you select this folder then click on select folder obviously yes and now you're done now you go to your downloaded Claymore uh, zip file, uh, the zip file where you, uh, where you downloaded uh, the latest Claymore. Mine is this one. And obviously you need to re-extract Claymore. But this time you are going to re-extract Claymore filer, uh, fi uh, folder sorry, to the folder which we added in the exclusions. So uh, my folder in this case is this one. So you go ahead, grab the Claymore folder and you unzip it in here. And the reason why we unzip it in the first Claymore uh, folder that we have unzipped is because we added this folder uh, to the uh, Windows Defender exclusions. So Windows, uh, we, uh, we create the chance that Windows Defender does not uh, check uh, for any files in this folder. Now to, to be more sure, you just go again to Windows Defender, then go to Viruses and Threats, Viruses Threat Protection Settings, you go again to Exclusion, Add Remove, then Add an Exclusion folder, then go to the first Claymore folder you, do, uh, you extracted, go to the second one, which we just extracted, and click on this folder so 
when we activate Windows Defender it will not uh, look even on this folder so then you go ahead and grab the latest claimer folder which we unzipped okay obviously replace because it's the same folder and now we are done we can go ahead and reactivate Windows Defender because now it will not check on our folder so uh, basically uh, that's uh, that's it now you have a brand new Claymore uh, Claymore folder which uh, it's not stopped by Windows Defender any files uh, in this folder will not be checked and obviously you just go ahead and open uh, and open the miner and begin um, and begin mining but let's say for example you still get this problem let me do this again so let's say you still having this problem so uh, uh, now you know that you have eliminated the problem for the windows from the windows defender or from uh, your antivirus uh, now what uh, you need to do is go to your batch file click on edit and at the end you add the parameter pause then obviously you save it open the miner and now the miner it will not close uh, automatically but it will remain open so uh, in this way you have um, uh, you have the opportunity to check for the error and see why Claymore Miner is still um, instantly crashes or instantly <laughs> close. So uh, this uh, in this way you know uh, you can see the error why it's not staying open or, or why it's uh, instantly crashing. And as you can see in here, uh, if DCR Miner uh, 64 is not recognized as an internal command and obviously because uh, the file is not there so uh, now I can see why uh, why uh, my miner is crashing so um, yeah that's it for today guys I hope this was clear I hope this was helpful for you and um, as always don't forget to subscribe like and share the videos and see you guys on the next one bye bye